Hello Virgo and welcome to your January 2019 Future Love Reading. This is the series that you all voted on in December, so I hope you like it. We're going to try it out. Leave me a comment and let me know and we will keep it in our monthly reading rotation for you all. We're going to check out the situation here, Virgo. The feelings, the challenges, the actions, and all that wonderful stuff. And see what is going on here. This is for Virgo. January 2019. Their future love reading. This is for Virgo. This is for Virgo. This is for, okay. Whoa. We have soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Okay, I know for a fact, I think Libra got this. <laughs> I think Libra got this. Somebody else got this. This this card has not been popping out all that much lately. Um, but with these future love readings, you know, whoever this is, this could be one of your soulmates, Virgo. And um, they're calling you in. We got two cards with the words soulmate. I just want you to check that out. Soulmate, soulmate, and they are calling you in, using that law of attraction, praying, positive affirmations, visualizing the two of you together, right? So, they're calling you in, Virgo. You are their soulmate. They are aware of this, right? Very strong connection here. They are calling you in. All right, let's see what is going on with this. All right, this is for Virgo, January 2019. Future love reading. If this resonates with you, Virgo, please like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you, Virgo, Please check your moon rising and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Virgo out there. Please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. So however it resonates with you. This is for Virgo. This is for Virgo for January 2019. Future love reading. What is going on here? Okay. All right. There it is. Whew. Okay, so, man, they want things to speed up here. They really want to come rushing in. Expect the unexpected, okay? Expect the unexpected. They are calling you in, Virgo. So, um, right now, uh, the, the challenge for them is waiting, okay? They're getting very impatient. So, this Knight of Swords energy... Yeah, definitely impatient. They want to rush in and make this happen. Okay. We have this Knight of Swords energy. This is air, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I've got fire here. I've got air here. I've got earth here. I've got water here. And I've got the magician here, which is, you know, um, Aries energy, right? So... This could be literally any sign. But I'm going to read the energies of the cards... Okay, so we have the Knight of Swords here. So this is them rushing in, traveling to you with some truth. Okay, they, this is what they want to do. I feel like they, it, the, I feel like they're being, growing impatient waiting here. They are trying to call you in. All right, we have this Knight of Swords energy. So expect the unexpected here, Virgo. Just saying. It could be an unexpected text, phone call, knock on the door, whatever the case may be. They want to talk. All right, so the situation is growing heavy on them. This could be a person that you have um, ended things with in the past because tens are endings here. I... I don't think they're giving up on this just yet, but they are growing very, very impatient. Okay? So they may be rushing in here. All right. They, 
You see how this person is holding on tight to all of these wands? I feel like that's what they're doing. They're bent, they're not broken. But I feel like this waiting is driving them nuts, okay? And I feel like they're, they're ready to drop the waiting portion of this situation. Um, and you, you know, this, you know, could be somebody from your past that you have ended it with. This could be a fresh new energy, whatever the case is. They want to let you know how they are feeling. They want to get this show on the road, okay? How they feel, they admire you. They've put you up on this pedestal. This could be somebody you work with or go to school with. You see how these people are looking up to this person, you know? Um, Three of Pentacles here. This is Earth, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So... They, it's like they're admiring you from afar. And the challenge here is, Virgo, the waiting. They're so sick of waiting. And they, they just may bust out of the gate here. Just so you're aware of that. Um, but they're looking out into the future. They're waiting for their ships to come in. Um, for some of you, the challenge is that maybe you, Virgo, have turned your back on them at some point. If it's someone from your past. If this is a newer energy, they're just waiting for that right time to uh, rush in there and let you know a few things, okay? They've made their decision, right? So we went from, you know, the two is a decision, the three is a decision has been made, and now we're making plans. We're making plans. And you see how his hand is on that one specific one. Their decision has been made. Now they're just waiting for you to, you know... Come on in. They're calling you in. But the waiting is very getting very, very difficult for them. What action will they take? The magician. So, again, these two cards, it's the, it's the same thing. Calling you in. Prayers, affirmations, visualizations. Okay? They're working their magic. You, law of attraction all over this okay so they feel like they got all the tools to do it all right so they're they want this new beginning here with you virgo and they're doing everything in their power to make it happen to call you into them to get something started here okay now I feel like they're going to get their wish fulfillment here, okay? I feel like th this is a wish fulfillment for them. You are their wish fulfillment. You have the Nine of Cups here, Water Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So let's clarify this Nine of Cups for Virgo. Please clarify the Nine of Cups for Virgo. January 2019 for their future love reading. What's going on with this? Yeah. Mm. So I don't think people, and here you are at the bottom of the deck, so let's set that right there. I don't think that you are 100% ready to be honest with your feelings um, when they do rush in, okay? I don't know if, if you're 100% ready to do that. I think that's what the Seven of Swords is representing right now. Okay. So, strong soulmate energy here. They, you know, they could be doing a little bit of drinking while they're waiting around for something to happen between the two of you. Okay. Just saying with that nine of cups there. But I don't think you're 100% ready to be open and honest with, with what you're feeling right now in this situation, okay? Now, there could be some uh, sneaking around involved. There could be some dishonest behavior here. And maybe that's, you know, what is uh, causing this big waiting period here between the two of you. Now, that's a possibility. But here at the bottom of the deck, 
we have this queen of pentacles energy right this is more earth this is you so you are completely in your power here right and you are being very focused on um, your career you're very focused male or female does not matter very focused on your um, self-worth very focused on taking care of yourself and those around you okay i feel like you really stepped back into um, your power here i feel like you're on top of your game these days virgo i really do but there is somebody out there that just is so crazy about you and they are trying to call you in okay i you know maybe you you drop this person in the past before if it is somebody from your past for dishonest behavior okay so just so you know they're still wanting to make this connection they may do a surprise phone call a surprise text a surprise knock on your door so watch out for that because they are manifesting 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 and and they cannot let go of the situation for you they're getting they're growing impatient and i feel like they're going to be reaching out to you soon virgo so watch out for that okay you are what they're wishing for you are what they dream about you are what they're praying for okay and they they're still they're still trying to work their magic here virgo all right so that is your january 2019 future love reading let me know if you like it leave a comment and um we'll continue to do it for you all okay i go live sunday through thursday with the daily message around noon eastern standard time and then uh, friday is the live love luster loss also around noon eastern standard time uh, next week, I'll be getting out the February monthly reading, so I'm excited about that. I get to change my tablescape. Very excited about that. All right, you all have a great week. Take very good care of yourselves, and God bless.